dear students in this module i am going to discuss the chemical composition of rna rna or ribonucleic acids this is another major type of nucleic acid present in the cells it is also a polymeric compound just like dna as you know dna is made up of deoxy ribonucleotides but here rna rna is made up of ribonucleotides so ribonucleotide is the monomer of ribonucleic acids so each ribonucleotide is made up of three components and these three components include a ribose sugar a nitrogenous base and a phosphoric acid so these three components they join together and they make a ribonucleotide and different ribonucleotides they join together and they make a polynucleotide which is ribonucleic acid here uh, this is the first component of uh, ribonucleic acid and this is a pentose sugar here the pentose sugar is a ribose you know in dna this sugar is also present but this is present in its derivatized form and that form is deoxy ribose sugar you can see at carbon number 2 an oh group is present here but in case of deoxy ribose sugar only hydrogen was present oxygen was removed so here the pentose sugar is ribose instead of deoxy ribose this is first component of a ribonucleic acid the second component of ribonucleic acid is the nitrogenous base there are mainly two types of nitrogenous bases present in the ribonucleic acids and these are purines and pyrimidines two types of purine bases that is adenine and guanine are present in the ribonucleotide these two bases adenine and guanine were also present in the deoxy ribonucleotide the next two types of bases that is pyrimidines and these are cytosine and uracil here you can see a difference in case of dna uracil is not present and instead thymine was present in dna molecule but here instead of thymine uracil is present so overall there are five types of nitrogenous bases these are adenine guanine cytosine thymine and uracil thymine is only present in dna molecules while uracil is only present in rna molecules the third component third component of a ribonucleotide is a phosphoric acid phosphoric acid you can see it has three hydroxyl groups and these hydroxyl groups they have ability to make ester linkages with the hydroxyl groups present on the pentose sugar either ribose or deoxy ribose so uh, ideally it can make three ester linkages but normally in a polynucleotide chain it makes this phosphoric acid makes two ester linkages so this is uh, a complete ribonucleotide it consists of all the three components that is a nitrogenous base a pentose sugar and a phosphoric acid these three components are joined together and they make a ribonucleotide and this ribonucleotide by combining with other ribonucleotides it make a ribonucleic acid